Hi travellers, I'm Anne's daughter Liliko. This is day four, day one of quarantine, of hotel isolation in Shanghai. It's raining. But I've done some laundry this morning, so it's just drying up here by the heat pump, which yes, I do like to have it warm. I haven't had any knocks on my door for any meal. This morning when I took my rubbish out at whatever ungodly hour, because they only, you can only put it out at a set time, I noticed that there was a meal sitting there, stone cold. It was clearly from yesterday. So I don't know if it's because of that or what, I have no idea. It's fine because I'm eating my food that I've bought. <laughs> me? If you haven't seen that video of me unpacking all of my pantry supplies, then please check it out, but it's, I'm doing all right with that and it's fine. Now I'm just ordering, and I should have done this yesterday, but oh, jet lag. I am just ordering a SIM card, sorry. So it says here for the phone number, if you're in a quarantine ha hotel now, yes, that's me. You can write down the phone number of that hotel. So this is with Nihao Mobile. I just searched for it. This is WeChat. I'm getting the smaller plan because I'm in here for so long and including the next one. So far, the Wi-Fi has been all right. It was a little bit slow, but China internet is slow anyway especially with the Express VPN, which is what I use. So it's linked in the description box below. I've had work this morning. It's ugh, it's just lunchtime now. I'm just like, I'm dying, I'm dying. I slept well yesterday, last night. And yeah, you can see my little setup here. I've just got my laptop charging over there. And my bed was comfortable enough actually with just the one mattress. This is actually yeah, the mattress topper just took it off and put it on the floor i don't know why but i prefer to sit on the floor because then at least the the laptop is high so i'm not looking down because if i sit there well there's no way i'm going to sit on this chair for anything more than five minutes <laughs> that's that's one reason why i'm not there but also the desk is so low compared to the chair that i wouldn't be sitting at the right height and my only option is to sit on that suitcase which is uh, i mean it's a possibility but it's not great because that box is not gonna hold me <laughs> i suppose i could sit on that on my chest of drawers but again then it's still not high enough for what i like i just i don't know and i know this isn't the most ergonomic whatever whatever it is what it is it feels like surviving not living and thriving i did some yoga this morning on this mat so that was good. Yoga with Cassandra on YouTube because she has like little 10 minute sessions which is so perfect when you're like running late for work. It's enough, especially for sitting on the floor. It's like enough. So I'm like feeling much better at my body. So that's nice. Because I've got work. Excuse me. I love how it's literally, I think it's 12.30 right now and I'm yawning. Yeah, I think I haven't got time for boredom because there's so much work that I need to be doing slash have missed over flying here. I'm just trying to catch up but it's not happening and I don't even know what I'm reading. I'm like, mm -hmm. and then like, I asked them to record a meeting which was fine and then I listened to it. I completely zoned out. I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm struggling through. It's just getting temperature checks twice a day. Now that I'm getting knocked on the door for, there's definitely somebody smoking in this building because it comes under the 